Guess I'll step up to the podium and speak. Fuck the blue lighter. He's a gold one. I'm the gold child, son. Coming up in a world where the nigga really ain't never had shit. Put a whole lot of drive and a little bit of loud in my passion. Put the whole lot of whole so whole lot of Hola, everybody. How you doing? Como estas? Let me stop playing like I speak Spanish because I don't. But it's your boy Chuck Diesel, aka Lone Wolf. You are now tuned into the Lone Wolf Chronicles. And today is Move Monday. All right, so for this Move Monday, it kind of will relate to my last week's Move Monday, which was talking about the time is now and momentum. So there's something that one of our movement and voice teachers would tell us all the time. And I just play it in my head sometimes. Like, I don't know. Dan Dennis, shout out to you, bro, because I feel like you, you low key stuck with me the most, some of the things you would say. And um, one thing he told us was it takes energy to create energy. And that was pretty much just telling us to stop moseying around and actually do the work. And so if you don't know what Suzuki is, first off, I say you should probably look it up. You'll be interested. Second off, um, this was specifically true for stomping and shakahachi. And it's pretty much kind of what it sounds like, stomping. But you stomp for a while. It's like either five minutes or ten minutes straight, you stomp around the room and just, just look it up. There's a whole form to it. Suzuki is a crazy training and I was a varsity athlete. I lettered my freshman year. I was always at it. Went to state multiple times. Like, I was an athlete. This class still had me I was dying. And so it would be 9 a.m. and he'd be like, it takes energy to create energy. Let's get to it. And we're like, uh, nigga, I'm tired. Like, maybe at 10.30 when I'm actually awake. And he, he accepted this for a little bit. So we would just start off with our exercises, a little stretching, and mosey our way up until the process until we hit a 10. And then one day he just flipped the switch on us completely and was like, all right, so usually we start with warm-ups. This week, we're just going to jump straight into the practice. Let's do stopping and shakuhachi, and then we'll do down in 10, and we'll get into our forms. And we're like, what? Well, this is what we're doing. And so instead of it taking us an hour and a half to get into the class, we would do this stomping and shakuhachi in a warm-up, and 20 minutes later, everybody in the room would be like, Ooh, let's go. We can do that. We can do that. We can do this. And we just found, like, a fresh gust of energy. And instead of being a waste of an hour's worth of class before we were actually there, we would use the whole two-hour class and be at our highest height of energy. And so pretty much what I want to say is just jump right in. Just dive in full force. Like, don't play K and just do the bare minimum to say you're doing it. Jump straight in because you might just find that spark that'll keep you going for the rest of it. Like you'll build up momentum. And also you can just get caught up in the process and in what you're doing and you don't even realize how much work you've actually done or how long you've even been doing it because you just got caught up in that one little spark of energy. And another thing that I always think of as an example is it takes energy to make energy. In order to get a fire going to cook your food, you had to get that piece of coal. And that piece of coal was the energy starter, which then gets you the heat, which is your other energy. And then you make your food, and that's the energy to you. It takes energy to create energy. And so, just start, just jump in, just dive right in. Like, the world yours is waiting on you to take it. I just walked out the thinking things I was told, but I'm packing. Got a whole lot of Oh yeah, if you don't already know, Wolf Wednesday is right around the corner, so check in for my latest release. I got a banger coming out for you this week. You'll like it.